dancer, singer, Jojo Siwa is here at SoFi Stadium, the WrestleMania kickoff party. You were there, Corey. She did a TikTok video that garnered 16 million views over four days. I was there. Jojo and I are pretty much best friends these days. I'm thinking of becoming a professional TikToker. Guess who's back? <laughs> back again! <laughs> yes! I'm back on SmackDown. Your role model, the longest reigning SmackDown Women's Champion in history. A ding-dong. Hello. <laughs> living under a rock this is dakota kai and this is eo sky your new wwe women's tag team champion that means we can go to any brand any time and do anything we want smackdown is Oh, I'm sure now. <laughs> That's right. Because we destroyed Raquel and we put poor little Elia on the shelf. <laughs> because this is what greatness looks like, all right? This is what it looks like when you do exactly what you say you're going to do and you don't just sit around and you wait for someone else to do it for you. Because what damage control has is something you all crave but will never get because you suck. <laughs> The power to win championships, the power to determine the future of Raw and SmackDown, and the power to plow right through anyone that tries to step in our way. Good luck. If you're talking about power, you've got to mention this young lady. Perhaps the most powerful woman in WWE, Raquel Rodriguez. I don't see greatness at all. Sabes lo que yo miro? You know what I see? Three bullies that hurt my partner and are powerless at stopping me from getting revenge. And Raquel not backing down. In fact, she's driving all three members of damage control. Rodriguez certainly in a nasty mood tonight. What? What are you yelling at me for? Bailey's got right. Raquel Rodriguez one-on-one -on -one next here on Friday Night SmackDown.